the end of the day, it's not that big of a deal to me. No, hold up. No, you know, I just like... Well, I'm gonna spit my noodle out, yeah, cuz. Like, do I need a YouTube intro? I don't think so, you know what I'm saying? I always gotta eat good, I'm a food enthusiast. Welcome to the mukbang. Oh, this is mom. Yeah, okay. That does look good. Yeah. This is barbecue eel, bro. You see that? I don't know how far behind Damn, bro, I, I food is big as hell, bro. Oh, oh, God. It's in the back, hold on. Is it that behind? No, I see it. You see it? Yeah. That little gas? That does look good though, like barbecue eel. I hope it tastes good too, bro. It was way better than I expected. Are we doing music for the stream or not? No, that's the rest of the question. Oh, yeah. oh, that's right. I was going to say that we're doing music for the stream. I forgot to change the YouTube video. Dumplings, and then what was the other thing you ordered? What's oh, I just said Moe. What's that? Oh, that's the first question. Bro. What's this? I don't know. Yeah, I'm staying. I don't know. That shit's pissing me off, bro. Oh, the thing I got was called. It's not even in the air, bro. It's just actually moving on its own. Got yeah, gyoza. Oh. It's pork dumplings, bro. This this low key looks just like. Dude, that is disgusting. This looks like the most white was. Uh, this is regular dumpling, bro. I don't know how behind this stuff is, bro. This it's not that bad. It's not. I think it's just on the iPad thing. They can see it, bro. Ooh. Yeah, it's actually moving, bro. And it's not like the air, bro. This is what is this? Taco yaki is octopus, it's fried octopus balls or something like that. And it's moving. Ew. Okay, so this one loud. I'm gonna have to switch. That's Damn. insane. <laughs> of course, when I show it to the camera, it's not, it stopped moving, bro. You're dumb, don't let you it. And these two got the spicy miso ramen. Oh my goodness. It's, it's like to the top, too. It is. Oh, gosh. There's an egg, pork, spinach, noodles. I don't know what else is in here, but I don't want to spill it. Matthew, can they see this? Yeah. I don't want to spill it. Yeah, they can see it. Yeah. Oh, I thought it'd be like scrambled eggs. Nah, it's just a regular egg. All right. You know? Go down there. This is the same thing. Yeah. All right, so I got to show it. Hey, you too. Say hey, you too. Well, we got to say our first person. All right. Dear Lord, I want to thank you again for letting us be able to come together as friends and to have this healthy and good dinner in front of us. Please bless the hands that have prepared this food and please bless our bodies to be able to take it and enjoy it in your name. I pray. Amen. Amen. God, so love you, Kim. Yes, love you, Kim. I can eat 
it doesn't taste like that. It tastes more That's like it tastes more like a, a crab cake to me. It just don't taste good. Like it's like real pushy. Mm-hmm. So what you don't give it. Okay, now it's gaggy. So over dramatic. Octopus is not that bad. No, octopus isn't, but that is. But I tell you, Matthew actually finishing his. Don't taste like it. What are you and your friends' short term goals? Matthew, would you like to go first? Oh, uh, graduate college. Type shit. That's all we got. I would say graduate college for me, I agree. I would say also stack as much money as I can before I fully get thrown into the real world, everything. So, stack bread for a few years, hopefully move out, try to get my own crib and everything. For now, that's what I would say. But of course, get my degree in the next two years, of course. Yeah, I'm thinking real short at the moment. I'm just trying to get a 3.5. I need another D list, bro. Okay, yeah, you think it's extremely short. Extremely short. I say short term is like two to three years, though. And then for this to pop off, you know what I'm saying? So I can do more live and IRL stuff for y'all. Boy, this deal look, this deal look good, bro. If I bite into this and it's not, Bro, I freaking hate this. I don't have a hard time thinking. Can you bring the paper towels over here? Yeah. <laughs> you good, bro? <laughs> that ain't slapping. The bar is very nice. I bet. You want to try it? You're not. Are you talking to someone? For y'all in the Twitch stream, y'all already know. But for y'all on YouTube, that's something y'all don't need to worry about, you feel me? Yeah. We literally have an order. Where go? Mm, not really. Go ahead. What what is up with you in these two word answers and stuff? That's the answer. I cannot really elaborate on the situation. The vibe. Not really. And it says nothing else. Anyways, um, Officially single as of a few months ago. Girls hit me up because it's a new day. Um, lover boy cam in the chat, of course. But I mean, after a three year relationship. <coughs> <coughs> Damn, my bad. You know, I'm just allergic to bullshit. My bad, my bad, my bad. YouTube. My bad. You passed eight minutes, bro. I don't bro. know what he's talking about, bro. Like I said, yeah, officially single now. Um, not talking to anyone. Loving life, making money, and doing school work. It's all I do, bro. I ain't talking to no one out here, bro. It was not hitting right now, bro. I was giving you a good nine. It was good. I thought. No, no, no. It's good, but it's just, it's just. I don't know what it is. Like, it, I think it might be the taste. I don't know what it is. The like, taste good. The texture is what throws everybody off. The, the, the taste is good. How much did this all cost? You know, <laughs> motherfucker. Goddamn. Don't worry about it, my brother. You know what I'm saying? Man, do I need an answer on you on this one, bro? We're still in the girl talk, bro. I gave you my answer, not really. No, I know, but I need your answer on this one. Uh, we'll see. All right, since we're already on the I don't even talk to anybody. Somebody said natural or makeup. Uh, who went last? Who went first last time? I did. Matthew's first. So Matthew's first. Mm, I said natural. Oh, my fault. Um, I agree, natural. There's nothing wrong with makeup at the end of the day, but um, personally, if I find you attractive naturally, like with natural bare face, then uh, that's the best thing possible. So I'm going to say natural. I just like how I said, Matthew, don't give me a one-word response. You gave me a one-word response. Bro, we've been doing that for every question. But me personally, I'm taking the same thing that Cam said. It's got to be natural. Like, makeup is cool and everything like that. No explanation. Like, at all. Like makeup is cool, don't get me wrong. Like if you wear makeup every now and then, you do you boo. You know what I'm saying? You do you boo. But natural horny. If she can look good and natural, that's all you need. And that's that's fact, all you need. I agree with the So mm -hmm. Go with the octopus. I'll let you keep the octopus. I'll give that like a seven and a half. You're a better man than me. That junk is a foe. A foe? That's crazy. Fo. So I should go ahead and do it. It's got head. like no it's got no taste to it. It tastes like a hush puppy with meat in the middle. No, that's what he is. Yeah. Ah, I know you have. Alright, go ahead and do your um, heel. Alright. In my opinion, the heel is actually good. It's just like the texture is throwing me off. I can't eat the te like with the texture of it. It's just weird. But with the avocado and rice, it actually tastes pretty good. So, I give it like a... 
get like a seven and a half. It could be a little bit better. The barbecue sauce is really what's Karen. I ain't gonna lie. I think that's the black in me. Yeah. Oh, what else? Do you mean? Don't us. Don't us like you already ready that though. You did that one already. Uh, so I guess the, the ramen chicken. I get this. Four. 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 I get this like uh, eight and a half. I get whatever's left. Until he gets a boy. For all y'all, the one more <laughs> joke about that is Matthew is the last of the Armstrong clan that they have. So if he doesn't have a boy, the Armstrong family dies and there's nothing else. Bloodline, so, gone. Yeah, that's why he means till he has a boy. Yeah. Even though the question was, what age do you want to have your first kid? But alright. Oh, I thought it was just how many kids. Oh, since we're talking about how many, I mean, might as well. So what age, though? Oh, uh, probably like a year or two after I get married. Just because I want to enjoy my marriage first for a little bit. I want to travel with my dad. I want to be, I don't know. I'm <laughs> Neil Armstrong. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be old with kids. Like, I don't want my kids to like hide stuff from me and stuff like that. So I'll say I agree with like two years after I get married, somewhere around there. But I really be like, like, yo, mm, like one, late 20s, early 30s if I have a kid. I want to have a kid after I've traveled at least two places. He will have an accident one. We're gonna stop it. Okay. But, uh, instead of Matthew going first, I'll say, for a number of kids. 
package, three tops. Three is the limit. No more, no less. I agree with that. I think I don't want more than three is realistic. Unless I don't have a boy. <laughs> so stupid. I would say two or three, to be honest. Um, I'd rather have a boy first, like as my first kid be a boy. And then the rest of it doesn't really matter, but I need a boy at first. Um, but if I have three boys, I'm trying for two more, and I'm just going to get started lined up. And that's all that matters to me, Joe. Okay. Have a team full of hoopers. <laughs> Feel me. I want two, one boy, one girl. Fair. I, I like that one, too. I feel but like the house needs a balance. Stuff. The house can be pretty, like, if you put out a balance. I don't know. But I feel like my mom is a tomboy who deals with all boys in the house. That's how it was for my, my dad and my stepmom. There was three boys and four boys in the crib. Yeah. Just her. But you know, since we talking still about, starving. since we talking, I don't know what you're talking about. Since we talking about kids, this question was crazy. When I read this on Instagram, bro, y'all had it, bro. How would you feel if your daughter started on OnlyFans? Somebody else. I'm not starting that. I wouldn't be happy. <laughs> That's all you guys said. At first, at least. <clears throat> Until she made money. No, it's more like a... <laughs> when he see that retirement check, he'll be like, you know what? Keep doing your thing, girl. Hey, more than me my whole life. <laughs> God. No, it's just, yeah, like, at, at the end of the day, it's not that big of a deal to me. No, hold up. No, you know, I mean, like... Well, I'm going to spit my noodle out, though. Know, like, at the end of the day... You got it. Whatever my child decides to do, if it makes them happy and they make money, I'm fine with it. Yeah, you freaking got it. I'm going to be honest with you. Um, go ahead, Josh. Nah, it's just not happening. There's too many weirdos out there. Way too many weirdos, Way bro. Too many, bro. Y'all seen it on here before, firsthandedly, you know too what I'm saying? Far, too but, far, too far. Man, nah. We'll have a stern talk with Beyonce Stern. That was terrible. You know um, that Stern? Um, OnlyFans is haram, it's bad. We do not endorse OnlyFans, first of all. So, with that answer, I'm going to say no. That's not happening, bro. I'll, I'll be damned if my daughter starts an OnlyFans, go. We need to bring back shaming, bro. There's nothing wrong with shaming people. Because that's the only reason. <laughs> I'm that, not going to say no, no, that. No, 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 no. I'm not saying about the OnlyFans stars. I'm saying about the people paying for it. Because it's broke. Okay. It's, it's more to life. It's more free things, if you know what I'm saying. But, yeah. Since this is going on YouTube, we will not go any further than what I just said. Uh, I say it. Go find some girls in the real life, bro. These girls <laughs> online is not you're not doing a single thing with them, bro. Stop it. Stop watching OnlyFans. Anything. This is YouTube, so I'm gonna keep it PG. But OnlyFans and anything related to that, stop watching it. If you're a man, put it down. Don't even go that way to go pay for any girls, bro. Moral of the story. Oh my fault, Zane. What sport are you going to try to get your kids into? Basketball. My son's a hooper. There is no other option. I'm yeah. sorry. I'd like to play basketball too. Why are you putting your son in basketball, bro? Stop it. Send him up for failure, bro. Stop it. You see the struggle Isaiah Thomas going through, bro. Stop it. Unnecessary. My, my kid's going to be the next most Wait, Boy, is Isaiah Thomas taller than you? No. I think he's. Yes, he five. is. He's 5'7, I think. I swear he's 5'9. No way. I'm not. Damn. I knew it. I'd be disappointed, but I mean, it's life and her bad. I mean, yeah, but at the same time, it's like very few people really make it off on the fans, you know what I'm saying? Like, just the ones we know of are the ones that's making like a lot of money. It's a lot of people who do on the fans that don't get paid barely anything. Yeah, yeah, that's very true. I don't know. I just think we're in a generation, this only fan stuff needs to stop in general, bro. We're. Making men a lot less weak than what they should be by going out here and watching OnlyFans and paying for it. Y'all just going out sad, bro. Yeah. Go like you're, to girls I heard. you're losing your. No, I'm not going to make this political. But you're, you're losing a lot of male energy that you should be having by going out here and paying for OnlyFans. I'll say that and keep it simple. Completely off topic, though. Why did you choose Kentucky? I was supposed to ask that after the dropout team. So my dad went here, and they were doing a bunch of college visits at my high school, and they were like, so do. and they were like, um, my dad was like, hey, can you go to the Kentucky meeting just for me, you know, hear about what they say. I was like, yeah, 
yeah, okay. So now they're camp with me. And then we were, you know, listening to them talk about it. And we're like, oh. Shout out to Ashley Beck, by the way. I'm like, oh, wow. This place is actually pretty cool. Yeah. So, uh, same way. Well, I mean, I've always been a fan of college basketball. Of course, Kentucky is one of the leading sports, or leading schools in college basketball in the U.S. So, I was already a fan of them. Um, go to the meeting with Matthew, talk to our recruiter, Ashley Beck, and I was like, you know what, they're fired, bro. First, I saw the dorm rooms, I was like, yo, the dorm room sold everything, I ain't gonna lie to you. That's the it's, it's a tax to go here, but the dorm room was, yeah, it sold everybody on it, so that's where I'll say my decision came for it, to be honest, and then it's really, it's close to home, to be honest, but a quick five, five hour drive ain't nothing for real, so that's where it came at for me. I chose Kentucky because I used to live here because, like I said earlier, military, so I moved a lot. I lived here when I was like five. I went to one basketball game with my mom, and ever since then, I've just been hooked in the Wildcats, bro. And then I'm, when I moved to Texas, Texas didn't want to give me scholarships, and Kentucky did, so that's where we at. Dream school, and it happened, you know. Chase your dreams. Anything is possible. Anything is possible. That is very true. Well, not anything, but just work hard. Our words be telling. Always. What was the next one? If they're able to lower injuries by time, that won't happen. How did you all meet? Hmm. All right, well, I met Cam through DJ, and then I met Matthew through DJ. So that's how that happened. <laughs> <laughs> no, like, bro. Bro. Um, well, first of all, because y'all don't even know who DJ is, so I'm going to just say it like that. But DJ is my little brother who I've known since literally two years old, probably. So, um, and then they actually went to high school together. No, middle school. High school, middle school. This high school. school. <laughs> he said, how do you meet DJ? I met DJ ninth grade year of high school. Yeah. And like, you know, it's like this little thing where it's like, black people just always all know each other. So he was on the football team. I walked up to him, I was like, what up, bro? And then it was just, yeah, from there. And then Matthew yeah. met DJ through me, literally through freaking Xbox party for year. two years. Yeah, yeah sophomore, sophomore year. Playing Fortnite back in the days yeah. till 4 in the morning, cause, and then they've been friends. Bro was still awkward with DJ for like three years straight, but I mean, it is what. You want to put money on it? I can call DJ Hill about. For what? Maybe, Matthew maybe. Being yeah. awkward for like two, three years after me and DJ on Xbox. I yeah. have a year and a half. I can put money on that. It was three. Like. Food overall, uh, they can go first. I'm a little, I'm a little on the, the negative side of it right now. I give it an eight. Eight. I'm gonna give it an eight three. Honestly, bro, I'm so full. I'm not gonna lie to you, cuz I'm ready really to pass out. But the food was fire, though. Like everything that I ate, it was fire. I, I don't know if I would go and get it again, like on the regular type thing. But it was fire, though. So I give it like an eight three, eight five type thing. I think I just ordered the wrong thing. If we being honest, you know, factual. Like it wasn't terrible, but it just it didn't live up to the expectation I thought it was gonna live up to. So I'm gonna give it like a seven. Yeah, I give it like a seven. Like the dumplings was good, but dumplings are basic. And then the octopus, I don't know, it just didn't have a flavor to me. And then the eel, the taste was just off. But the eel, the eel and the barbecue's gas. So I, the eel. Yeah. I'm trying to figure that out too. What am I looking? I think it's a, uh, yeah, but. Yeah, that's a, yeah. Left guys. Yeah. That was interesting. Um, is it a local restaurant? I think so. I'm not sure. I've never seen it anywhere else. It's called, it is. it's right here. Yeah. It's Umi, bro. Yeah. Umi Ramen. Umi Craft Ramen. Yeah, that. It wasn't bad. Like, I just, I just think I just ordered the wrong, the wrong thing, because their food was good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was gas. So I ain't Their food was good. Like, I don't think I'm gonna reheat this and eat it, but like, it's it was all, hard. It's all microwaveable too, because they all say, uh, what's it called? That is very true. Mm-hmm. But yeah, it was a dub, though, I ain't gonna lie. Wait, do we wanna do the monkey? Craziest thing you've seen while at college? I got no idea. Bruh, I got that same street thing. I gotta think about that. I don't know, bruh, I've seen some, some wild things here, cuz. Uh, I'm gonna tell you right now, bro, if you go to university, bro, you're gonna see some wild things, cuz that's just more of a story. Try to reset. Me. Ooh, I seen something crazy today, bro. I just thought of that. <laughs> Are you? No. Yes, yeah, he is telling that story. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna take out the I don't think you know. Okay, okay, never mind. I think it's a different thing okay. I thinking about. Oh, I was thinking of the squirrel. Oh. Oh, you wanted to tell that? No. Why would I tell your story? Oh, I was gonna 
Florida. 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 Whatever, go, go. Yeah, but I, I guess we got a few different stories then. Well, today, dude had it. Just look like, you know, one of those forest people who just had the hair and everything just out. Like, you know what I'm talking about? Like, That's it's one of those girls who be like, <laughs> no, one of those, like, how those girls be like, I don't need to shave so my body and my, like, oh, yeah. stuff like that. He had his armpit hair grown out, his beard was all grown out, and he was walking barefooted on campus. I'm talking around campus barefooted. Like, yeah. Next time I see it, I'm gonna take a picture and show y'all. Cause I've seen it three days now, and I just thought it was a one day thing. Buddy's been barefooted the last few days. So, if y'all see something on Snap, just know that's him. Homeless? Nah, he goes to school. He had no, an iPad. I've seen him before. He had an iPad and everything today. He, he, was, he was here. He was in education, barefooted and all. Um, uh, one that I would keep normal and stuff is it's Smoky Balls. Smoky Balls, by the way. Pause. Can I see um, that? Mm-hmm. Huh? Can you see right there? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Parents weekend that we have every single year is literally the most absurd place that I've ever seen in my life, bro. Because yeah. these parents act like their children that's going to college and they think that they're still in college also. But I was walking with DJ one day and it was like broad daylight at like two o'clock in the morning. Parent is as drunk as the kid is. And it's a whole family. It's a son, daughter, father, and fucking wife. And then... But now the mom was so drunk, bro. Literally so drunk. The dad's trying to like carry her. Drops her ass into the damn street. She's too drunk to actually get up. So she's just stumbling while his car is driving past her the whole freaking time. At like 2 o'clock in the freaking day on a freaking Friday. So Kentucky's a very odd place, basically. Moral of the story, man. Yeah. Okay, before you go, Matthew. Do you think you would ever quit streaming? Probably not at this point. Is 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 actually getting somewhere unless life start kicking my ass. <laughs> Are the balls good, Taz? Balls. Answer you know? the question. Answer the question. Yes or no? Yes or no? You can't say nothing but yes or no. The monkey balls. No, 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 no. You can't say nothing but yes or no. Is the balls good, Tadashi? Or. Okay, so lame. Matthew, what's your craziest story? It's hard to come up with a specific craziest moment. I feel like it's just out past nine o'clock this season. Interesting to say the least. That's true. Like, Thursday through Saturday. Yeah. Mm, it could be honestly any day. I mean, yeah, but the crazier yeah. is Thursday through Saturday. Um, I mean, just today we saw that, that couple just making out on the. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. <laughs> I totally forgot about that, bro. It was so hard. I didn't even see that. We were literally driving the program and we're just going past the light and just broad. Well, it, Not broad daylight. It, it was dark, but it was bright enough to where you could see them perfectly. Just full out make out sitch right on the side of the stream. Just like, what are y'all doing, bro? Hey, if you got a girl, bro, y'all trying to get freaky deaky, bro? Take it inside. Go hit the crib, dog. You all, we all live around the campus somewhere, bro. Take it. Go inside right, the farm. No. Okay, because that's a lot. And I want to eat half of that. What? I just wanted to let you know. You're only eating half of one? Half of both. Why? Is this super sweet? This girl is. It's super sweet as you just ate two cheesecakes in the past of forty eight hours, no, bro. Stop it. I had a cheesecake yesterday. And, and one the day day. before that. Yes. Is that not forty eight hours? Dang, I went to. It was already two days. Damn. Yes. And there is stream evidence to prove it too late. Zots, I read your first message, bro. I'm ignoring you for a reason, brother. I love what you too. Uh, what do you guys? Mm-hmm. Do I like balls? Last <laughs> <laughs> question: Where do y'all see y'all relationship statuses throughout co- or throughout the rest of college? Uh, why? Why? That's one no. Last question: Is off on a bang? Why? Why do you know on a bang? No, okay. You're straight. Taz and Reggie lovers till the end. Hey yo. What? <laughs> <laughs> <Hey, yo. laughs> <laughs> person I'm talking to now, I don't really know yet, you know? That's crazy. Uh, we're getting Mr. somewhere. Mr. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, let me have my moment, bro. I mean, we're getting somewhere. Ow. Um, if it lasts, it lasts. If it 
don't, it don't, you know what I'm saying? So, oh, yeah. at the end of the day, we're just going to see where it go, where it takes us. It could lead us to new roads, or I could be in the same destination, if you know what I mean. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> I hate this dude, bro. That just pissed me off. New roads, or stay, stay in my same destination? So yeah. unnecessary. But, bro wants to be poetic for y'all. Alright, Ken wants me to get the real answer. Uh... I hope <laughs> I saw that. Yes. I hope it can last until I graduate because that added distraction of adding another female and I gotta ask her what her favorite color is and stuff like that again. Can't do it. Can't it gets to know you process. <laughs> Can't do it. Oh my bucket. I hate my life. Alright, Matthew. Just till you graduate? Okay, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.